An Accra Labour Court presided by Mrs. Lorinda Owusu has ruled in favour of GBC a consent judgment case against one of its clients, Prime Media. Based on a consent judgment, GBC was to pay 9 million Ghana cities to Prime Media for breaching a contract to play adverts for the client. We have online the Director of Legal Services of GBC, Mr. John Kwame Waja, to give us more details on the ruling. Hello, good evening. Good evening, Valerie. How are you? We are doing good. Thank you for joining us on the news. This is good news for GBC. Why did GBC yeah. have to pay judgment debt to Prime Media? Well, you see, uh, the whole thing started when there was a between GBC and Buy Media, where Buy Media was supposed to come and buy airtime to get the, the advert which Buy Media was supplied. But along the way, Buy Media comes four years after. Because the contract started from around 2007, and by 2011, Prime Media was alleging that GBC are taking money and will not air those adverts. And so we call something on it. The, 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 the example went to court as a claimant to say that this is holding about 4,000 on executive floor, in other words, on air floor. And for that matter, he brought a claim against GBC. Hmm. Now, instead of making the GBC went into a consent judgment with Bad Media. In that consent judgment, GBC decided that, well, to have compensation, they were going to give the claimant 9 million Ghana CD. And so uh, uh, we, we thought that, that that amount of money was appraisal. And in a recent uh, Auditor General report, we recall that the Auditor General even advised government to pay that money. But GBC took a second look at it, examined its record. Look at the claims of Buy Media and realize that some of the claims were, were fraudulent. And so we issued a writ and then went to Labour Court, where her ladyship was also state to say that unless we are bringing a charge of, we are making a claim of fraud against Buy Media, so we asked her to stay and segment. In that execution, Buy Media had guaranteed all these accounts in the Bank of, the bank of Ghana, the commercial bank, and all our Ecobank you know, accounts and all that. And so we went to court and made our case. We had the opportunity to make the argument in about 10 15 minutes, which we did. And the opposition side also made the argument. And uh, her ladyship, Lauren, also came to the conclusion uh, in a girl of BBC has a case. In other words, BBC is saying that they have to so the court to give BBC the opportunity to prove that fraud. And that any, any, any money which ought to be paid under that judgment has been paid. So what it stands is that the guarantee has been has been discharged, which frees GBC's monies and so takes GBC out of that tight financial corner. But let me say that the importance of this case lies in the fact that that in its report, in annual report of last year, captured by media to the extent that GBC owes by media nine million dollar TV government who uh, uh, five million, nine, you know, so that is, that is by interest. So we decided that we'll look at the case again, which we did, and then the legal team advised us to go to court, and then uh, we will finish this ruling. So as it stands now, no money to be paid under that, 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 that consent judgment. Okay, okay. So what does this judgment mean to GBC moving forward? Well, you see, consent judgment just means that if you take me to court, and I think that I think that you. I decided that look, instead of going through a, 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 a tortured file with you, I agree. But you see, what our case is that those who start together to give that content judgment to buy media, they did not do that looking at the facts and looking at the records available in GBC. Remember, the GBC is a corporate individual. Yes. And so if GBC employs you to look at issues and you don't look at it the way GBC, but GBC can always go back to court and say that my officer did not act in tandem with the principles and as it were. Uh, the, the documents available, uh, which they should have affected their minds, they didn't do that. And so GBC went back to court, like I just said, uh, to ensure that uh, the execution of that judgment okay. did not take place. So that is exactly where we stand today. With Thank you. Thank you for joining us on the news. That was the Director of Legal Services here at GBC, Mr. Kwame Waja.